a rooftop camera and it is crystal clear. In fact, we continue with clear skies and high pressure today and tomorrow. Uh, Friday and Saturday, we get a little cloud cover. And then on Sunday, this front, that's all the way by the Dakotas now, that front is going to come through with our next rain chances. In the meantime, let's enjoy the dry weather. We started with 40s and 50s on the map this morning. We still have a lot of 50s out there right now, so it's still cool enough that you should consider a jacket. Uh, if you run warm, you may not need it. Maybe you can just pass it. But I'd say if you're a little chilly like me, jacket probably handy through about 9 a.m. Afternoon, it's short sleeves for 70s. And here's a town by town look. We've even got a couple 80s on the map in Springfield, Framingham, in Manchester, New Hampshire, down to Middleborough, upper 70s in Boston, in Ipswich, and Worcester today, 75 in Situate and in Provincetown. Now, tonight, it's going to be another cool one, folks. That means temperatures dropping back into the 40s and 50s by the time you wake up tomorrow morning. Get set for these as your wake up call, and then temperatures in the afternoon. Again, mid and upper 70s. It's another wash, rinse, repeat kind of forecast. Uh, so we've had several days to just enjoy the sunshine and the low humidity. Tomorrow is no exception. As far as the temperatures go for highs, we're pretty much on track with where I'd expect us to be in early September. Normal high is about 77. And although the mornings have been on the cool side, the afternoons are going to be pretty normal. Now let's talk about some of the changes to the weather pattern. Saturday brings in mostly cloudy skies. Sunday, we have scattered showers in the forecast, and you'll see that's when that front comes through. Saturday, we're essentially between systems, which is going to give us a healthy do a dose of clouds, but not much in the way of rain. I've just got a tiny little chance for a spot sprinkle on Saturday. Sunday, though, this is the morning at 8 a.m. You can see some showers around. And because the nature of this front looks relatively slow right now, it gives us an afternoon chance for showers as well. I'd expect them to be scattered. It's not going to rain everywhere all day. And we're going to be able to fine tune and hopefully narrow that window for rain as this gets a little closer as well. So seven day forecast.